I have the surefire way to help your voice. So I am not a loud talker. Although I pause to say that because I do believe that my husband would disagree. Sometimes you need to get your voice elevated to kind of cut across all of the racket. So one thing that I absolutely love is my microphone. It looks like this. In fact, it comes in like a variety of colors. The reason I love it is because it's got this little tiny speaker here, which is pretty powerful, and it has this guy. When it comes to wearing this mic, here is what I recommend. The mic is meant to be worn like this. I feel like a pilot. I found it really distracting because it would either pinch up here or it would mess up my hair and we can't have that. Decided to then go the Britney Spears route and I always wear my mic now around my neck. Just either put it really close to my mouth when I want to speak to students or if I'm talking to a student one-on-one -on -one and I don't want to mess with turning it off, I just kind of angle or move it down. This guy is supposed to go, I suppose, on a belt or in your pocket. Personally, I think it's much easier to wear it with a fanny pack. And then I take this guy and then I clip it right here. It really does stay put. Hey guys, how you doing? Everybody say chicken nugget, chicken nugget, or whatever kind of attention getter you have. But you can see that even if I'm speaking softly, you don't have to raise my voice. And then if you really want their attention, then you can just put your hand over like this. Attention passengers, we're about to head for a crash landing. It doesn't take batteries, so all you have to do is charge it.